Hi, welcome to Math Talent Channel. Today you we will learn about visualizing and describing the different solid figures. Come, let's learn together. We have here a table. In the first column are the given figures. We will sort these into corresponding the different types of objects. The second column is for the two-dimensional figures or 2D shapes. The third column is for the three-dimensional figures or 3D shapes. Let us learn various types of two-dimensional and three-dimensional shapes together. The first figure we have rectangle. Rectangle is a 2D shape that has four sides, where the opposite sides are equal and parallel to each other. We have figure 2. A cylinder. A cylinder is a three-dimensional solid geometrical figure that has two parallel circular bases connected by a curved surface. For the figure 3 we have a cube. A cube is defined as a three-dimensional square with six equal sides. Figure 4 is a circle. A circle is a closed 2D figure in which the set of all the points in the plane is equidistant from a given point called the center. Figure 5 is a triangle. A triangle is a three-sided polygon, 2D shape, that has three edges and three vertices. Figure 6 is a pentagon. A pentagon is a five-sided polygon, 2D shape, and it can be regular or irregular. In the last figure, we have a hexagon. A hexagon is a flat shape, 2D shape, with six straight sides. This time we will name the solid figure that each object represents. The first object we have books. Books represent rectangular solid figures. Next is a tent. A tent represents a right triangular prism. We have globe. A globe represents a solid figure of a sphere. We have a drum. A drum represents a solid figure of a cylinder. Another, we have a party hat. A party hat represents a solid figure of a cone. We have dice. These dice represent a solid figure of a cube. Lastly, a pyramid of Egypt. The pyramid of Egypt represents a solid figure of a square pyramid. Let us remember the following important definitions of today's lesson. Let's define and understand the following. Spatial figures. These are three-dimensional figure. It is made up of plane figure whose all sides are joined together to form a close figure. Some examples of spatial figures include cubes, cylinders, cones, prisms, pyramids, spheres and rectangular prisms. Polyhedron is a solid figure whose sides are all polygons. Each side is called faces. Two faces that intersect in a line segment is called an edge. Two edges that intersect in a point is called a vertex. Prism is a polyhedron that has two congruent parallel faces called bases. Pyramid is a polyhedron whose base is a polygon, and the lateral faces are triangles. Cone are a unique type of three-dimensional figure that have length, width, and height. A cone has a single flat face, also called its base. That is in the shape of a circle. The body of the cone has curved sides that lead up to a narrow point at the top that we call a vertex. This is the curved sides of the cone. And the narrow point which is called the vertex. Furthermore, the cone has its height, slant height, vertex, and circular base. Next, we have cylinder. The cylinder has two circular bases that are congruent and parallel. A cylinder has one curved surface. Another solid figure we have is sphere. Sphere are perfectly round. Sphere have no edges, no vertices and no definite base. A sphere has a curved surface of point that are all some distance from the center. We have another spatial figure. The rectangular prism. It is a three-dimensional solid object. The rectangular prism has four rectangular lateral faces. With twelve edges and eight vertices. Let's check the illustration of this solid figure. To show us the illustrations of its edges. 
Rectangular prism has 12 edges. Let's count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12. Rectangular prism has 8 vertices. Let's count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Rectangular prism's three dimensional parts, namely length, width, and height. Take note. The bases of rectangular prism are also faces. Similar to prisms, pyramids are also named according to the shape of its base. Square pyramid has a square shaped base. It has four triangular lateral faces with a total of five faces. Let's check the dimensions of these triangular lateral faces. A pyramid is a polyhedron that has a base and three or greater triangular faces that meet at a point above the base, the apex. The most famous example of such a pyramid in real life is the Great Pyramid of Giza. Our next example of a solid figure is a cube. A cube is sometimes also referred to as a regular hexahedron or as a square prism. Some real-life examples of a cube are an ice cube, a Rubik's cube, a regular dice, etc. A cube is a prism with a square base. And all its faces are square. With four lateral faces. Let's visualize the dimensions of the cube. All faces of a cube are square and have six lateral faces. Cube has six faces and twelve edges. The other 3D shaped solid figure is a right triangular prism. A right triangular prism is a three sided prism, it is a polyhedron. The right triangular prism is comped of two triangular bases. Three rectangular lateral faces. Let's check each dimension of this right triangular prism. All in all, right triangular prism has five faces and six vertices. Let's learn more. Try to solve the problem by completing the table. Write the number of faces, edges and vertices of the spatial figures shown in the first column. We have cube, rectangular prism, sphere, cylinder. Cone, triangular prism, sphere, and cylinder. Once you're done, you may check your answers in the description down below. Enjoy and good luck! See you in the next video.